and common cause always willing to before he became prophet you know that famous contact a helpful fadul he has a contractual relationship with non muslim different tribal chiefs and he was part of it and what was it about any time a poor and oppressed person is hurt will all stand up those people who signed that treaty will all stand up in support of that person did it say they are going to be muslim did it say they have to be from their tribe no for every oppressed and poor who is wronged muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said along with other non muslim all stand up for them. and one day sitting in madina and that state of madina came into being with a contract and that contract was signed by by muslims of madina yathrib and also by jewish people and the christian tribes and the mushrik tribes and that entity in that way came into being and he was sitting in that first state of islam madina and somebody some discussion came about helpful fudul he says even if even if today now he is prophet he is in power he is the leader of the of the beginning of the islamic civilization 1400 years ago he say today i am invited to sign a contract and work with others helpful fudul i will go for it and that is exactly the tafsir of ta'awunu ala al-birr wa at-taqwa wa la ta'awunu ala al-ism wa al-udwan so working with others for a common cause non muslim is a way to relate an opportunity to communicate we have done all the time in habasha muslim stayed in habasha 15 years some of the muslims even after hijra and madina established and there's a lot to be learned there 